Can you see my slide? Okay, my name is Fajr Siddiq and I'm from Singapore and I'm a serial entrepreneur and also an indie maker, influencer, producer, professional UA player as well as digital nomad and designer and developer. So it's just me, basically, my laptop, paying bills and buy me coffee. I'll explain to you more about the buy me coffee later on. And the topic for today is actually why should I not stop coding? So this topic was given by Osama uh, Kosim and thanks uh, for inviting me today. And today I will share with you more about Built with Jamstack. Uh, pretty much, uh, I'm sure everyone uh, knows what's Jamstack. So basically, it's JavaScript, APIs, and markup. So uh, what I do with that is uh, using GitHub. So you can actually uh, upload like HTML, CSS file if you're using Bootstrap. Uh, and if you're using Jamstack like Gatsby and some other uh, front-end uh, stack, you can actually uh, host it on GitHub. And what I'm using for this project uh, for my website, fajasidic.com, is actually uh, using Netlify. So I make a URL a short link and I can share easily from here. So you can see that. So you can just uh, create a redirect uh, simply from there, from the GitHub. And then uh, what I do with that, so basically I build uh, communities and micro startups, meaning small projects. So the reason why I build uh, communities is because to build my own audience. So I think building audience is really important, uh, you know, to get out there so that people know what you're building. And as well, like, you can share knowledge and you can share uh, among uh, friends from all over the world. And apart from that, uh, you can build micro startups, uh, meaning small projects. So uh, you don't need to think so much of uh, building a big company or registering a big company. You can just build one company and then you can have uh, multiple projects and which means uh, micro startups. And micro startups you can scale even faster uh, with uh, coding and also no code tools. And as well you can build a quick MVP. And micro startups you can also launch. So you can grow your audience. Uh, so I built Ramadan Makers uh, for one example. So uh, we have done this for almost like a year right now and it's on Telegram and it's really interesting and very engaging. So the reason why we choose Telegram uh, is because it's uh, fast, uh, secure and of course privacy and uh, they have dark mode, it's really nice and you can chat with people from across the world there. And the next thing I want to share with you about open startups. So basically sharing metrics and stories when I share about metrics meaning that uh, your views, how much your views. Uh, on your site and also how much uh, uh, monthly recurring revenue you're earning or annual recurring revenue you're earning and there's so much more about that for open startup so uh, this is a culture thing where you share with people your achievements and how you are progressing running your website or your app so next thing is uh, about uh, analytic on like the site that is being viewed so I use this tool called simple analytic and it's very um, Important apart from just using a Google Analytic, I know Google Analytic is uh, good, but I use uh, this one be because of privacy friendly and it's always encrypted. So I can just uh, share this link to anyone who wants to view my uh, uh, how my page is doing. Next thing, I'll share you about buymecoffee.com. So it's uh, basically it's just tipping culture. So tipping culture, like you know, you do a favor for your friend or for your for for your you know community or like your client. Uh, so you don't need to like just pay like a full amount kind of thing like you know a lot of people they do like uh, transaction like buttons and then you know they use PayPal or they use Stripe or some other uh, maybe bank transfer so I use a very simple uh, tipping culture uh, thingy that I like which is using a buy me coffee so people can tip you so inside buy me coffee they have a lot of stuff like uh, your monthly uh, recurring support and uh, like visitors and you can create so many much more things like example you can add in like you create an event so people can actually uh, uh, pay your event to watch you go on zoom for example so you can use buy me coffee is really uh, useful and uh, yeah it's something like similar like to patreon and uh, everything else like coffee.com ko-fi.com but i'm using buymecoffee.com because uh, you can integrate uh, stripe and there's so many much more features uh, that i actually need as a creator or as a maker so next indie hackers so indie hackers is a, a place where you can actually post discussion and uh, people building SaaS projects and as well as share their uh, journey as an entrepreneur or founder or a bootstrap startup uh, so you can actually uh, verify it with stripe and you can share uh, how your revenue is growing and you can see other makers and other people who's building products and you can see um, their 
statistics and how much they're earning uh, via the Stripe. So it can actually integrate with Stripe. So I'm pretty sure uh, Pakistan is not launched yet, right? I think so. Maybe sooner or later, I guess. So next is uh, Make a Lock. So shipping in public, shipping public is really interesting because uh, you get to see other people shipping as well. So it kind of get you motivated. So uh, whatever you're building, whether you're creating a website or app or video content or maybe writing your newsletter or podcast. So this is a very great community founded by Sergio Matei from Puerto Rico. So uh, I suggest you guys who wants to start coding and start web development, you can actually join uh, Make a Lot uh, for free. And of course, none other than the most famous ProductHunt.com. So you can launch a product here, you can get a lot of views, you can get upvotes, you can get leads and pretty much uh, product related. So, uh, you know, this is really good. So I've been on Product Hunt for about a couple of years, uh, but only active like two years, uh, like, like in 2018 and 19 and only uh, this year. And Product Hunt is great. I'm one of the founder club uh, influencer. And also, uh, you can produce your own content as well. So it's very important for you, those who do coding, you should share your code on tutorial or you know turn it into a medium uh, content. So what I do is just that I write a blog, right? So I have my uh, blog over here, and then as well as I uh, do the podcast, and I make videos on YouTube as well, helping other makers to make uh, launch videos. So this is really great. So it's very important to turn uh, your content into a medium uh, for a medium purpose so that you can people can benefit from your sharing and and it's great to uh, engage with other people with your content so next thing is like uh, some of the featured articles and share so I was featured on code.org for building a no-code game uh, using uh, some of these platform making game super makers you can find it on product hunt and I was featured on make mag as well as influencer so influencer is something um, that every community should have like uh, what should you influence others uh, like you know about tech stack or maybe like uh, some apps or maybe some website so people need to share about the reviews like you know sometimes you have so much payment uh, payment gateway which one to use which is better which fee so uh, as an influencer this is what uh, I do so I usually do a lot of testing and I try to understand their products in terms of like, product designing or product management and then I, I influence them with the product so some of them I do reviews like for videos as well so other than that like I was invited to be a judge so this was uh, fixathon.io so uh, we do climate exchange uh, uh, projects like there were about I think 400 over people so it, so it was a hackathon and then I was one of the judges among all other people from all around the world so it's a really interesting project um, you can read more about that I can share you the link if you want to and yeah so coding also helps you solve problem in terms of creativity so with coding itself I created videos uh, I don't know how it helps but uh, by building a website and I launched uh, my company called in productions I have 50,000 over uh, subscribers on YouTube and yeah, it's really interesting. We create uh, Islamic content like Quran recitation and some Tazkira, like, uh, you know, for spiritual uh, thing. And then uh, people can actually uh, get benefit uh, about this. So I've been running this for more than six years. And uh, before, before the COVID-19, before the work from home or remotely. So this, uh, this culture of working remotely also help to solve uh, people. And other than that, uh, you know, keep learning and growing. So the more you learn, the more you earn. So this is the books that I got from like Stripe Press. So they have some of the books like uh, uh, from Increment. So I read it and uh, talk about open source, talking about uh, documentation. So they have many uh, book issues. So you can just go to website increment.com. And there's another book called Get Together. So I read that book. It's really good like for building communities and of course uh, Quran so Quran is really interesting so Quran is something uh, uh, help me spiritually and also uh, get my goals to do everything so completed the Quran in the month of Ramadan uh, so uh, read some pages like four pages every uh, namas or any uh, every time every prayers every salah every you know Zohor, Asar, Maghrib, Isha and Fajr so yeah so you can read my articles here uh, some of it uh, you can I can share you in my link and um, I was also awarded uh, for the uh, committee member of the year uh, at product hunt committee member of the year product hunt here 
and also uh, Makers Festival. Recently, I just got awarded as well. So you can read my article on my blog. So I, I, I share a lot of insights of how you actually can build a digital product and also not digi non-digital product as well and how to actually engage in a, in a community. And last but not least, uh, the stack links like uh, for coding. So uh, here are some of the links that I actually use. It's pretty much very easy for those who wants to start. Uh, the reason why I use Gemstack is because it's secure and it's fast and because of privacy and it's static, you know, it's static is nice and you can use API to actually integrate anything you want. So everything is fast. So you can use uh, like statbeat.com, uh, Netlify, GitHub, uh, Gemstack Teams as well here. Some of the source that I actually collected. So if you want more, I can just share with you. But here, just a few of it. So thank you so much. Uh, for more, you can uh, check out my slide, fajasiri.com slash learn to code drive. And thank you so much uh, to Cosim. Thank you so much to Cosim for um, inviting me here. I'm very happy uh, to talk to you guys. Can you guys hear me, right? <laughs>